bonito bandera, qué bonito bandera, la bandera puertorriqueña. Revolution gang if you haven't subscribed yet then make sure that you click the subscribe button below and join the revolution so as you could tell by her little performance at the very beginning of the video today we are going to have a cross-cultural exchange we're gonna be doing another language tag now normally Angie is the one guessing South African words but today she is gonna be making me guess some Spanish words as per the request of some of you who wanted to see it on the flip side are you ready Am I ready? That's the question. That's a real question. Oh. Am I ready? I know that we can do it. I mean, you know, I think I'm ready. You know what I'm saying? Like, me and hombre es Benita. You know, vamonos. You know what I'm saying? Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Cinco. You know what I mean? Lo siento. Tranquila. Agua. We do keep quiet. Hey, vamonos. Let's go. Come on. So I'm gonna be hitting Benita with slang actually. It's like not proper Spanish, but like it's between like slang between my two cultures because I'm Puerto Rican and American, you feel me? So first word is cocotazo. What? Cocotazo. Um Oh uh, oh uh, damn Hell oh uh. Cocotazo Cocotazo Is it a coconut? Coconut Tango? What did he say? Hey. Oh. <laughs> what the f was that? Oh, for my Spanish people in the chat, Lord. <laughs> okay, so it's an action. And an it's, it's something that, um, you know, it's, it's almost like a threat. A threat? Cocotazo. I'm gonna beat your ass. In what motion, though? I'm gonna punch you. Sure. Yeah, right. Is it right? It, it generally yes, because coco tasso is like almost like a hit to the head. Like your parents would would hit would like threaten you with a coco tasso. <laughs> okay, so how do I use it in a sentence? Like, if you don't do your homework, I'm gonna coco tasso you. No. Okay. I'm gonna, you gonna get a coco tasso. So ladies, listen. If your man goes out late at night, doesn't come back, doesn't answer his phone. You just let him know that he's gonna get a cocotazo when he comes back. And that's on period. We don't believe in men abuse, so. Esta bufiao. Esta bufiao. Esta bufiao. Esta bufiao. I'm sorry, but it's giving me Esteban. Esteban Julio Ricardo Matoy de Rosa Ramirez. She said Esteban Julio Ricardo Matoy de la Rosa something Ramirez. <laughs> he said something Ramirez? <laughs> Cause I don't know all of his last names. Okay, say it again. Esta bufiao. Esta bufiao. Esta bufiao. Esta bufiao. It feels great to be on the Esta. Bed. Okay, well, esta. Esta is like coma esta. I'm hearing the word esta in there. Esta, but it's not with, well, like, you know, whatever. Is the esta, is, is the esta. It's, it's the same as the same esta. esta. Okay, okay, okay. Coma esta means how are you, right? Yeah. So, como. Esta. So does you, does esta mean you or how? No. Do not think these two phrases are the same because they're not. Okay, okay, okay. Give me a hint. Okay, you're. It's like a compliment. You're beautiful. No. <laughs> that ass fat. No. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's not necessarily like compliment. Wait, what? It's like a compliment. <laughs> it, it could be a compliment to anything, like an object or a car, like that you think, like, oh snap, or oh wow, like you know, you know, they're, they're like looking at something like, oh money, it's <laughs> Hey, that is nice. <laughs> 
That thing is like, that's fire. Yeah, I definitely gave it away. <laughs> It's not both y'all, it means like, you know, that's dope, that's fire, that's cool. Okay. Woo! Okay, that had nothing to do with coma esta, guys. That had nothing to do with I it. I told you. Chuleta platica. Chuleta platica? Chuleta platica. <laughs> does platica have everything, to, does platica have anything to do with platano, like plantains? No? I said it too fast, but it's plastica. Oh, plastica. Okay, say it again. Chuleta platica. Plastica? Is that plastic? I mean, yes, but in this phrase, no, because it's like. Uh, is it like I'm gonna hit you with my jumper? What? It can be used in a phrase like a threat, yes, but it's not like an act of, like, you know, discipline. Give me a hint. So. You would say this to a child in most cases, like, out of like, anger because, like, you know, children are children. You're being annoying. You're being stupid. No. <coughs> I'll give you another hint. The, the, and nine times out of ten, the, like, the kid is in the way. Or it can, it can even be a regular person. Like, they're just in the way. Say it in a sentence with emotion so I can really grasp it. Santa de medio, chuleta platica. My mom used to say this to me all the time. Get out the way? I mean, yep, in a sense, just get out the way. So chuleta is like a like steak, but like platica is plastic, but together it means like, you know, you're not you're not like see-through, like get out the way. Half sway. Actually hard guys. <laughs> I feel like this is unfair because of how do you think I felt? I gave you you gave me hints that basically I had to use context clues and I'm doing the same thing. You think I was gonna guess the words that you get you told me out of nowhere? I don't even hit buckle out her though. Like what? <laughs> well, how was I supposed to guess what the <laughs> I remember when did you remember that one? Remembers means they they, will they really you. did hurt. <laughs> that means that I really did hurt you. You are hurt that day. Okay, I'm gonna give you a long. Uh, I'm gonna give you like a question response one. Yo, Neil, don't call me mean for this one. So, this say yes or no to this, but say yes actually. Si tu sabes pintar, si. I know coño is a swear word. That's like a boss but little the, like. But it's in the phrase, like. so I'm not actually translating the curse word. So, which one am I supposed to guess? The first this couple after I said C. The entire phrase together is like, you know, it's supposed to be like, you know, you know how somebody can be sarcastic, like, like, oh, like, you. It's, it's sarcasm in the entire phrase. I was, I was that was saying, a horrible I, clue, man. I, I, almost, I almost gave it away. That's why I was like... So this entire phrase, you, you're guessing all of it. But the thing is, you're not guessing each word for word. You're guessing, like, what's the, like, the motion. Including the C? No, you're, I told you, you're not guessing every single word. You're guessing the entire thing as a whole. Because it's in action. It's a sarcasm. But why do I have to say yes? Because the, the C is like, you know... It's part of the sar sarcasm because if you say no, then it ruins the whole context of the sa sarcasm. Oh my gosh! So say the whole thing. Usame pintan, si? Oye, pinto te al carajo, coño. A carajo doesn't necessarily have to mean like the curse word itself. Like you know, they use it in different ways. I ain't coming over here no more. That's the thing with Spanish. Words can be multiple things. <laughs> Give me a hint, please. That's so long! Do you hate me? <laughs> so, it's basically like, you know, you could say this in annoyance to somebody so that they could like, you know, leave you alone. Is this something like... <clears throat> Are you my friend? Yes. Exactly, you're my friend, not my man, so stop questioning me. What? It's just like that, but it's not, you know, that. How am I supposed? How?
how am I like? It's the same thing as chuleta platica. So is it like it's telling you to get out my face? So it's like, are you see through? But you want me to say yes though, so it can't even be. No, that. because like it's not. It's like saying like you know it's sarcasm like. I'm gonna tell you this, like the actual translation. Like, do you know how to paint? You say yes. Yes. Well, then paint yourself out my face. Like, really, nigga? I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. How was I gonna guess this? You didn't give me like enough hints, bro. Like, you were like, it's sarcasm and stuff. Like, like how am I supposed to get, like, what? I mean, I feel like if I would have gave you more, you would have like actually caught it. <laughs> What's the whole point of a hint? I gave you like three. You gave me. All three of your hints were like the same thing telling me that it's sarcasm. How was I supposed to guess? You guessed it right, but you guessed it in the wrong form of like what it was trying to say. Cause you didn't give me a hint that helped explain what you were trying to say. How was I gonna guess paint? Paint is not, the, the point is not the paint. The, the freaking point of the freaking phrase is to get the fuck out the of the face. The freaking point of the freaking hint is to you, is to help me guess the freaking word, but you're I literally told you in a different way to, to get this person to leave you alone. Cabron. <laughs> Let me cuss you out. Don't you call me a cabron? I wouldn't know what you're saying anyway. Do it. Get the roar. <laughs> now you're going to get monetized by Spanish YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> this word, this is like a, a cultural thing because this can be said in two different ways. And in, the, in Puerto Rico, they like, no, no, I'm just not giving you a Puerto Rico word because it'll give it away, you probably know it. Um, chavo. It's chavo? The, chavo is the, um, the Dominican way. Like, the more, the more Dominicans say Chavo than, you know, Puerto Ricans would ever know what to do with. You said Chavo or Chavo? Cha chavo with the V. Chavo. With the V. Chavo. Chavo. Is it a chancla? No. <laughs> um, chancla is a, is a Spanish word. How are you going to ask a chavo if Chavo is chancla? Because I thought it was a synonym. Oh lord. No. Okay, give me a hint. Um, a hint. You would use this, and you would use this in stores. In stores? Is it a, a, a cart, a trolley? <coughs> yeah, one more guess. What do you use in a store? Is it a money or a card? Yes, travel is money. Oh. In Puerto Rico, they call it dinero. Girl, I wouldn't guess dinero. Why didn't you give me that one? Because dinero is simple. Everybody freaking knows what dinero means. What changura? Don't actually ask me that because I don't know what changura means. Because that's that's I think that might be like that's a something for my mother. Hold Wait, on. Wait, changura is actually a Spanish word? Yes. Girl, oh, that's actually essay slang for money. <laughs> All right. Four. 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 Spell it. F-O. Four. Four. Is it... Four. Is it... Food? <coughs> I mean, you could say this about food. Delicious? Delicioso? <coughs> uh, no. A hint. The opposite. Disgusting, not nice, gross. <coughs> okay, but not those words exactly. I fall. I it stinks. Uh, I gave it away. Okay, that was a, I gave it away. Yeah. Four. Four. How do you use it in it? How is it like a uh, yo? Let me tell you about this one time. I went on a date with this man. He was beautiful. He was dressed nice. And like, oh my gosh, like he was so funny, he had a great personality, but I fall. He's dang, yeah. <laughs> Please give me my citizenship, guys. At this point, like, <sighs> main hombre is Benita, and we don't like niggas because I fall sometimes. And uh, it, it's the uh, plastica, and um, yeah, I want chavo. Guava. Guava? Guava? 
Iwawa, Iwawa is different. What's the word? Iwawa. Wawa. Wawa. And you don't mean Wawa. I don't mean Wawa. <laughs> I don't mean Wawa. Hurry up. Um, be right back. So, Wawa is an N is an object. So, like, the way I said it, like, wait for me and then Wawa. Wawa. Wait for me and then Wawa. It's an, and it's an object? Very large one, indeed. Wait for me in the Wawa. Car! <sighs> but in most cases, they refer to it like a bus. Like, oh. but, but like we refer to it as car. Some people will say Wawa and is in like, who bye bye Wawa, like you're gonna get on the bus, or like, you know, I battle in and Wawa, wait for me in the car. Oh my gosh, that's so, this is so hard. I feel like the words sound nothing like their meaning. But then again, I, that's because I'm thinking in English. Mm -hmm. Woo. You know what, at this point, I'm evaluating this whole friendship because I think she hates me. I think she hates me because you gave me the hardest things I've ever seen in my entire freaking life. And you need to speak more Spanish to me. I, I don't, I, it's, it's just different for like when you're raised, like, you know, in a Spanish household where all they speak is Spanish, but then you have to like live like a life where you like have to speak Spanish to some people, but English in like majority of the places you are, sometimes like processing like the English and the Spanish is like hard. There's like a lot of kids that are like just like me in my age, my generation, that don't even know Spanish, but they can understand it. Mm -hmm. Because like to say words, like to actually think and process it and say it out loud is difficult. So like for me, like I can know exactly what to say. I know the words, I can say it, but then the way I say it with my, with, I don't have an accent, so then you can, like, in the country, you can tell I'm kind of Americanized. Espera que tu gusta, gus, gustaba. Espera que tu dis, gustaba. Espera que tu gustaba. El video. El video. What else do you want to say? Okay, so, espera que tu discava el video. I, I don't know how to say make sure. Yeah, we're going to have to, yeah, we have to. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe, and we will be back with more videos. If you want to see a part two of this video, then comment down below. Any videos that you want us to do, comment down below and let us know. Peace and love, guys. Adios. Adios.